Welcome to PC Error Detective. In this video, we're going to show you how to fix kernel data in page error in Windows 10. This issue can be frustrating, but don't worry, we've got a couple of easy methods to help you solve it. First, open the Start menu and type Control Panel into the search bar. This will let us access system settings that control performance and memory. Click on the control panel from the search results to open it. This is the central hub for most of your system configurations. Next, search for Advanced System Settings in the control panel and click on it. This will open a window with more in-depth settings. Under the Advanced tab, look for the Performance section and click on Settings. This area controls how your system handles visual effects and performance options. Once inside, go to the Advanced tab of the Performance Options window. We're going to make some changes to your virtual memory settings. In the Virtual Memory section, click on the Change button. This allows us to modify how Windows uses your hard drive as virtual RAM. Uncheck the option that says Automatically Manage Paging File Size for All Drives. This will let us manually control memory settings. Select the option called No Paging File. This temporarily disables the system's use of virtual memory. Click the Set button to confirm your changes. This applies your new memory settings. When prompted, press Yes to accept the warning. Don't worry, we'll restart the PC to finalize the changes. Click OK to close the virtual memory settings, then click OK again to exit the system settings window. Now, close the control panel completely and restart your PC. This will apply the new settings and may fix the error. If the issue still isn't resolved, let's move on to our next method, using the command prompt to check for disk errors. Open the Start menu again and type Command into the search bar. You'll see Command Prompt in the results. Right-click on Command Prompt and choose Run as Administrator. This gives you full access to system commands. If asked, press Yes to allow it to run. This will open a powerful command line tool. Now type the command chcake-dskey-f-r and press Enter. This tells Windows to find and fix any disk-related errors. When prompted, type Y and press Enter. This schedules the scan to run the next time your computer restarts. Finally, restart your PC. Windows will scan your drive and attempt to repair any problems that could be causing the error. And that's it. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to PC Error Detective for more easy fixes and helpful Windows tutorials.